I definitely grew up in a family that was, was awesome, but we definitely had struggles as a family. And I noticed myself going to something extreme. Like I would go and do something to the extreme, like skateboarding. And then I moved that energy into the band. And then it's definitely landed on fly fishing. And being that extreme just helped my mind to not worry about things and just to be able to go out and focus on just being out in nature and, you know, just loving life, honestly. I was never good at sports. I was never good at anything like that. And this fly fishing, you will never stop learning. I mean, at least you shouldn't stop learning because there is so much out there to keep growing your skill and the knowledge and the, the bug life and just streams. There's always something to learn with fly fishing because there's always something to look forward to, always something to build on, always a technique to go. Try on the water, see if it works, try different flies and that's why fly fishing also is so awesome because it's just it's just such a big living sport. It's changing and it's living. And it's it's awesome. The coolest thing I should say probably in the last few years was being the honor to make Fly Fishing Team USA and to be able to fish with anglers that are truly better than me. That was probably one of the biggest milestones for me in the last few years to be able to fish with these people that are, are just incredible anglers and to have role models like them they're awesome guys and will share their knowledge. And that has been huge for me to grow as an angler as well. I've been in many countries fishing, like South America and a lot over Europe and all over the country. And I wouldn't have been able to do that if it wasn't for the fish. You know, I wouldn't have gotten to see those places and have those awesome memories and, and meet those awesome people. I mean, I fish with world champions and it's invaluable information. And being a competitor and being someone who is trying to grow my knowledge and stuff, I, I would compete and that would get me to, to those destinations. And it's not just about the competing and, and doing well, it's more about the learning and just, just going to cool places. I've been one of the coaches of the US youth team for a few years and been lucky enough to go overseas and coach with them in the world championships and learned a ton and you know. Now I have my own guide service and I love to teach what I've learned. Um, it's so cool to to see those techniques and that hard work, you know, be able to be shared with these people and them do very well, you know, and become friends and get to fish with them. Nothing in life I've ever experienced takes everything away. Like every, every moment, every sadness, every anything, the, the world can be crashing down around you, honestly. And I'm just out there just focusing on that, you know, making the cast, catching the fish. And that's, that's honestly like, what has gotten me to love it so much. And the older I get, that's still a big motivator, but sharing that knowledge I've learned is, is definitely, you know, what drives me to do it every day. I just, I just love it. And to see the people, people succeed at it. It's not like a hobby, it's not a pastime. It's like definitely more of, I know it's a weird way to say it, it is a way of life to, to just, just love that and be involved in it. I, it everything, every, you know, <laughs> my work is fly fishing, my hobby is fly fishing, and you know, it's, it's pretty crazy, but it's what I love.